see this clown searching the bushes on the side of the road? That's me, Billy. I'm in a right spot of bother. Yeah, I've lost saying. I've been given an ultimatum. I either find it or I meet my maker. And trust me, I don't want to do that. You see, I'm in a spot of bother to this bloke. His name's Andre. People call him Andre the Giant, but it ain't because he looks like Andre the Giant, the American wrestler. It's because he's trying to drink more than 119 cans of beer in one sitting. That's what Andre the Giant, the actual wrestler, is the unofficial world record holder for. The reason why is because Andre lost his little girl on this lake where you just seen him. I feel so sorry for the bloke, but he can snap. It can snap just like that, you know? God's gonna have to have mercy on both our souls! So there you are, you see, I've annoyed Andre. I was supposed to go and pick up his daughter's little Bible from my mate's shop, Carmela. She's Italian. She's a daughter of a small time Italian mob family round our way. Hello? Hi, Carmela. It's Andre. Hi. Listen, I left my daughter's Bible in your shop and I need it back. It's got a drawing that she did inside of it. I'm going to send someone around to get it. Uh, sure, no problem. No problem. And that brings me on to this little lady. This is Rosie. She's another person I grew up with on my street. I knew her older brother. She's not your quitting essential British Rose, nah. She's not like she's grown from the beautiful British landscape. But she's got substance over style. She's got guts over grace. Like the salt of the earth. Someone you can rely on in the trenches. I've always liked her. You all right, Rosie? I'm not hey, Billy. Good to see you, mate. Good to see you. What have you been up to? Anything nice? Not a lot. Just got a text from Janet. Another one of her problems. Oh, she never stops that, obviously. Yeah. Tell you what, I've got a bit of work on. Go for a drive. Do a favour for a mate. I'll take you for some lunch. Yeah, sounds good. So that's what happened, you see. I went and picked up the Bible, got in the car, put it on the dashboard, and old Rosie, she didn't spot it, did she? She didn't spot it. Mad as she is, and now she's trying to do stupid things like protect me from Andre. She does the most daftest things too, like throwing his Bible out the car window. And that's it, you see. It brings me right back to these bushes. But I'm lucky. I've got my Rosie. My Rosie. She'll be there in the trenches with me. She'll be there looking for that Bible. She'll be there with me. My Rosie. 